an order from Taco Bell was at my front door at 2 o'clock in the morning. This is the Rock and Roll with a Man. My name is Sean Morrison. And yes, I am a little bit pissed off about it because I did not order it. What's been going on, which continues, is that delivery drivers, it could be for food, it could be for merchandise, it could be even for mail, that when they're coming to deliver mail, they're not going to the right apartment. Unfortunately, my building number and apartment number are the same number. So when they see that number, they're always thinking the food or the mail is for fucking my residence. No, it's not fucking jackass. Maybe you should fucking read before you come to the door and drop something off that's not mine. This has already happened once with food where they dropped off somebody's ice cream. Person never came, we threw it out. This Taco Bell thing, what do we do? We fucking threw it out. But we did wait for a while, but Taco Bell unfortunately cannot confirm whose it was. And that's another freaking thing. Some of these businesses with Uber Eats and DoorDash and all, when you call them up in regards to an order that's on your porch, when you call up the business, they don't really have that information. And then they say you have to call the DoorDash or Uber Eats or you have to hope on the mercy that somebody comes and picks it up from you. It's just goddamn fucking annoying. And at fucking 2 o'clock in the morning, you be freaking kidding me. And the reason how I found out was because I was leaving for work a little bit after 5 a.m., and there's fucking Taco Bell on my fucking porch. You gotta be freaking kidding me. Friends, if you're not subscribed to the Sean Morrison YouTube channel, please do so. Everyone else has to subscribe. We thank you for your continued love, honor, and support. It is greatly appreciated. The guy is lucky, whoever's delivering the food, that he only left the food. Because if you rang my goddamn fucking doorbell at 2 o'clock in the morning, you would have had a, another thing coming. Maybe you should have called the customer's number on the order and told them you and told them you were there with the food and maybe you would have came out to get it. Or maybe the customer should have used common sense and went to his fucking door. I mean you name it. It's it's food places, it's been a pizza place, it's done it twice, but since I have I spoke to the owner, it hasn't happened since. It's it's been a FedEx delivery. It, it, it's been Best Buy, it's been Domino's, and a bunch of whole other places, even a Walgreens, Walgreens medicine order for some lady. It is unfucking believable And you know what, after a year of this happening, since I've been at the current apartment with Janaki, it's getting fucking goddamn annoying. Read the apartment number and the building number and deliver it to the right fucking place because now my patience is being fucking tested. Hopefully, this shit stops because calling up the businesses, they're fucking clueless as well. Your thoughts? Shame, shame, shame.